du corvain tenosynovitis. It's a tenosynovitis, which means inflammation of the tendon sheath or the sheath surrounding the tendon. And it occurs in females, usually in like young or middle age, pregnant females who use their smartphones a lot for texting or carry their baby. So, she's telling here, this post hasn't gone viral. Okay, she's using her smartphone. And here comes her boss. You shouldn't use your phone during work. So, the etiology of this disease is not viral. It's not even known. So, it's still vague. And some suggest that it's work-related, like typewriters or people who use their smartphones a lot or women who carry their baby. But I'm having wrist pain because the symptoms are pain in the radial side of the wrist spasm, burning sensation in the hand, swelling over the thumb and the wrist, also difficulty gripping. The muscles affected are the abductor pollicis longus and the extensor pollicis brevis, which are, will be inserted here in the thumb. Okay, so her boss is a very kind person and a gentleman. Okay, that's Ducur vein. You have Ducur vein. You can take the day off because this disease is treated with some rest. She needs rest. What else? Splint and SAIDs can help. Steroids are the best. Surgery is rarely needed. Steroids sometimes are injected here into this tendon or into the sheath. Okay, there is a test to diagnose this disease called the Finkelstein test. What's the Finkelstein test? Three steps. Number one, thumb opposition. Number two, close the fist. And number three, ulnar deviation or wrist abduction. So, thumb opposition flexion of the four fingers, ulnar deviation. When you do these steps, pain is elicited along this line. Okay, so do cur vein. Do cur vein. Do cur pain. Do cur pain. Do cur vein. One, two, three, one, two, pain, do cur pain, Finkelstein test. Have a good day. Please subscribe to get new videos every single week and check out our channel on YouTube and like our page on Facebook. See you next video.